Merhaba. Our host Ain't is walking down 29th Street in downtown Yangon. She spots a shop selling shoes. This is the entry to the 29th Street back alley, which had been restored by Do Ain. Sadly, it has been closed off due to the COVID-19 pandemic. Across from it, the Mayflower Inn looks open. Ain goes to investigate. The receptionists tell me they, uh, they have been closing one month, now they're going to open again. Next, Ain't passes an open restaurant. Uh, they selling takeaway only. Lady selling the Burmese tea, like a fresh Burmese tea here. Is this Burmese traditional ice cream? It's go for uh, when it's like a dance sand. So let me try it. Mm. It's sweet and like a rich creamy. Ain't continues down an Oirata road. You have to order the food behind this line. These guys are making kima. It is filled with goat meat. And an egg. And then fried. Give it to my 
Eight buys a kima. This is a mobile vegetable stand. Now this guy is selling the vegetable with the bicycle. Now all of the market are closed. That's why they they just like using the bicycle, like moving around here. So earlier you seen me buy a kima. Now I'm gonna try it. It's hot. Mm. Inside. They put egg and coke inside. It's called kima. Really hot and mm. little bit spicy, but really nice cold, cozy weather. Now, as you can see, like uh, a lot inside. It's kind of like a full meal for you. It's really nice for, yeah, lunch or dinner. You can eat it. Guess what? It's only one dollar. <laughs> Ain't is walking up 30th Street. Now I'm in 30th Street uh, at the right tailor. I'm, now I'm gonna ask the how much cost for a soup. <coughs> For the shed is six dollar. For the whole suit is like a sixty dollar. Whole suit mean like trouser and you can get also coat and then shirt inside. Yeah. If you enjoy my video, you can also like this video and this video. For now, bye bye.